KFOS Original is a medication that helps control the amount of calcium in the body and urine. By making the urine more acidic, it is used to prevent calcium kidney stones. Additionally, it decreases the amount of ammonia in urine, reducing odor and skin irritation caused by high ammonia urine. This medication is also given to help certain antibiotics for bladder infections, such as methenamine, work better. For optimal benefits, the daily dosage and timing should be determined by a healthcare professional. When taking KFOS Original, make sure to follow your doctor's instructions. Typically, you'll take it four times a day with meals and at bedtime. Simply let the tablets dissolve in a full glass of water for three to five minutes. It's important to only use plain water, and if there are any pieces of the tablet left, crush them and stir well. Taking KFOS Original regularly will help you get the most benefit from it. Try to take it at the same times each day to help you remember. The dosage will depend on your medical condition and how you respond to the treatment. Make sure to take KFOS Original 2-3 to three hours before or after taking any products containing magnesium, aluminum, or calcium, as these can interfere with its absorption. This includes dairy products, calcium-enriched juice, and certain medications. Be sure to follow your doctor's instructions and not to increase your dose without their approval. Some common side effects of KFOS Original may include nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, dizziness, or headache. If any of these effects persist or worsen, it is important to inform your doctor or pharmacist promptly. It's important to remember that this medication has been prescribed to you because your doctor has determined that the benefits outweigh the potential side effects. Many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects. When you first start taking this medication, there is a possibility that an old kidney stone may be passed. It's important to notify your doctor immediately if you experience any serious side effects, such as bone or joint aches, muscle cramps, stomach pain, confusion, fast or irregular heartbeat, unusual weakness, tingling slash numbness of the hands or feet, or signs of kidney problems, like a change in the amount of urine. While it is rare, a very serious allergic reaction to this drug could occur. Seek medical help right away if you notice any symptoms of a serious allergic reaction, such as rash, itching slash swelling, especially of the face slash tongue slash throat, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. This is not a complete list of possible side effects. If you notice any other effects not listed above, be sure to contact your doctor or pharmacist. In the US, you can call your doctor for medical advice about side effects, and you can also report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or at www.fda.gov slash medwatch. In Canada, you can call your doctor for medical advice about side effects, and you can also report side effects to Health Canada at 1-866-234-2345. Before taking KFOS Original, make sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies or if you are allergic to any of its inactive ingredients. Also, be sure to discuss your medical history, including any high phosphate-slash-potassium levels, adrenal gland problems, heart disease, high blood pressure, kidney disease, liver disease, or any other health concerns. If you are pregnant or breastfeeding, talk to your doctor before using this medication. Remember to consult your doctor before breastfeeding if you are taking KFOS Original. It's important to be aware of potential drug interactions when taking KFOS Original. This medication may interact with other drugs, including aspirin, digoxin, certain high blood pressure medications, potassium supplements, and vitamin products. It's crucial to keep a list of all the products you use and share it with your doctor and pharmacist. If you are taking low-dose aspirin for heart attack or stroke prevention, you should continue taking it unless instructed otherwise by your doctor. Always consult your doctor or pharmacist for more details on potential drug interactions. If you suspect someone has taken too much KFOS original and they are experiencing symptoms such as passing out or difficulty breathing, call 911 immediately. Otherwise, contact your local poison control center for advice. Symptoms of an overdose may include severe diarrhea and muscle spasms. It's important not to share KFOS original with others. Your doctor may need to do some lab tests, like checking your calcium, phosphorus, and potassium levels, as well as your kidney function, while you're taking this medication. Make sure to keep all your medical and lab appointments and consult your doctor for more information. 
If you forget to take your dose of KFOS original, take it as soon as you remember. If it's almost time for your next dose, just skip the missed dose and take the next one at your regular time. Don't take a double dose to make up for the missed one. When it comes to storing KFOS original, make sure to keep it at room temperature and away from heat, light, and moisture. It's best to store it in a place other than the bathroom, and be sure to keep it out of reach of children and pets. If you need to get rid of any unused KFOS original, avoid flushing it down the toilet or pouring it into a drain unless specifically told to do so. Instead, consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company to properly discard the product when it's expired or no longer needed. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.